Um, okay, I've just realized that we're missing a field. In the database, we have um, the, user, the user object has the name, the phone number, well, this is not really, we're not gonna use it. But we need another, we need a new, um, we need a more data, we need a description, okay? So I'll go back to the collections and here, phone number, created time, I don't really need this. Uh, yeah, in order to not make noise, whatever I'm not gonna use, I'll delete it. Email, display name, yes, photo URL, yes, UID, yes, video presentation, yes, and description. For now, this is all I need, nothing else. So whenever I need more, more, um, more data, I will add it to the schema. Must contain collection for user, must contain created time, and must contain phone number. I am forced to do this, really? Okay, I didn't know that. Okay, I'll, I'll leave it. Control Z to undo, and I'll leave those fields. They don't really bother me. They're just making empty space and noise, but I think it's because I used the schema predefined that get, they gave me at the beginning, and now I'm not, I'm not gonna change that, so it's not a big deal. We, will, we might use it at some point. Okay, description. And uh, in my profile, I'll have to add uh, my profile. I will add, this is simple, this is quite simple. I'll add a new row. Okay, I duplicate this row. Instead of name, will be description. And I think there is a text, there is a component uh, called text, rich text with, no, text field, text field is okay. Yeah, text field. And um, the hint text will be, I mean, the description. Uh, no, this is it, description of yourself. Oh yes, description. The less, the less, the better. In text, uh, I like to travel. Blah blah blah. Um, and this, when we save it in the action of save profile, okay, in this action, hey, we were doing nothing here. Oh, this was this was mistaken. I wasn't saving the profile. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this was a big, this is a big thing. Um, when I save the profile, I need to update the name and the description because the, um, the picture and the video, it's already being saved when we do the, when we change them. Okay, when we change something, there are two actions and the other one already updates the document. So this is not really necessary, but the name and the description are now, are not being saved. So when we click in this, button, we'll add an action of Firestore, update document, which document, the document of this user, authenticated user, user reference, and the field of uh, name, display name, will be the, from the variable of widget state, the name okay in the second field the description will be from the variable of the widget state description okay great now when we we can change we can change the name and we can change the description and now we have a more uh, yeah this is we have the profile the profile ready. Uh, perhaps we should ask. We should add uh, multiple pictures, but uh, I'll leave it for for another time. Now let's go with the logics and that everything with the um, with the first release, and then there will be t plenty of time to improve this and add more features, more features, more features.
So I'm with, um, I get out, I log in as Sarah at gmail.com. I log in. Ah, wait, wait, wait a moment, wait a moment. Because the fields should load the previous data. If I go to Sarah, if I go to Sarah in the database, five star database, users, Sarah, no, Sarah has no name and no description. So it's working fine. My name is Sarah, description, I like to travel and uh, adventures. I save the I save this profile and let's see if it was yeah it was updated you see display name and description but I'm missing something what am I missing I'm missing the fact that when I if I go out if I log out and uh, I log in the name will not be preloaded if I get out and I log in again the name it's not loaded okay why because we're missing something we're missing the initial value uh, hint is the the suggestion label is the whatever appears on top and we're missing the initial value here initial value Okay, the initial value is going to be the authenticated user display name and the description, the initial value is going to be the authenticated user description. Okay, let's see now. If I reload, remember that we have to reload. So I'm with Sarah, I log out, log in again, Sarah at gmail.com, log in. Yeah, and now the previous description, it's being, uh, it's being loaded. Great, so this works fine. The profile now, the profile now is finished. Yeah, it's finished.